Hello, IPX here, and this is a uh, Minecraft. As you can see here, we've uh, done a few modifications. I built a wall around this area to protect it. Since last time I was out here, a creeper blew up here while a skeleton right over there was shooting me. I almost killed the creeper, but it shot me back and I leapt backwards and it blew up before I could get the last hit. So I took out this whole uh, sort of water tower bottom end here while I was trying to build this. See, this here is going to be for the windmill. And it's about, goes up to about 120 uh, Y axis. And I built this entrance here to easily access this area since I was always having to hop around. And I cleared this around so I'm pretty sure about this height they won't jump down. I haven't had anyone jump down here yet in a while. They were jumping down before when it was about that high. But now that should be fixed. And inside here are just prettying things up here and I moved around uh, my uh, machinery a bit. So let's uh, get down to busyness. So what we're going to build first, I think we're going to build the low voltage transformers. So here, that should be all the mats needed for the low voltage transformers. Yep, I did some prep work. <laughs> so let's look this up. LV. And where's this transformer? I think it's LV TAC. There we go. So we'll be building two of these. So we'll need two coils, because we're making two transformers. Bam, two. Pretty sure it was in the middle. Yeah, like so. We'll need these 14 cables. These there. These all lined up. And bam! Two transformers. So, how does this work? We'll be dropping 128 EU to 32 EU and I'm gonna position my shelf like this and drop it here. The yellow part is the input, the white dots are the outputs. <laughs> the reason why we're placing it like this is so the bat boxes get the power and the power comes in through there. Alright. Oh yeah, we must uh, make sure it's a step down and refresh it. So it's 32 output, 128 input. And again, 32 output, 128 input. And it's a fixed step down. Uh, now we're going to build a, medi a medium voltage transformer, or MV. We're just doing this as a safeguard towards my machinery and all that, all the low voltage transformers that are over there. So what we'll need to do is make the two tin ca uh, oh, copper cables. I think it was, yeah, going to make this machine casing first. Those two there and there we go. This I'll be placing it right here. Okay. Make sure it's a step down. 128 and I want the yellow things coming down this way. Yeah. Now what I need to do is place two copper cables there, which I have not prepared for. <laughs> Just need two of these and Oh, I was already got that prepared. I'll just grab two of those. <coughs> One, two. So that part should be done. Now we just need to make the generator and wind generator and the router for it. So this should be the wind generator and the router bit. Well, we'll, we'll see in a second. Yep, this is the right one. <laughs> so what I saw, we need a 
machine casing and two iron shafts. Basically how to make an iron shaft is by going to a compressor having about nine of these blocks and you it goes into here and oh wait that's the extractor that's the compressor chuck those nine in there you know it turns into an iron block then you get it into the metal former turn extruding on put the metal block in there and it turns into an, a shaft iron or iron shaft so what else do we need to do I think I was going to make the rotor bit which is making a iron gearbox rotor alright we need four of these one, two, three, four. One, two. Bam, four of these. And if I remember, it was like this. There we go. That's for the wind generator. Now we're going to make the old generator, which includes all these bits furnace, tin casings. Yep. <coughs> Let's see what Quinton wants. Right. Okay, second. Oh, it's not light. <laughs> All right then. Let's get back to business. We need to make a. Got it to click over. Oh, I have no idea what he's talking about. <coughs> All right, <laughs> back to business. Back to business. We are making a generator, kinetic generator. That is <coughs> or electric. No, no, no. Kinetic, kinetic generator. So that's what it, we need. I'll just type it in here so it's easier to find. Kinetic Gen. This is what we need. So, Iron Furnace is easy. If I remember, it's just that. And, pretty sure that's an electric normal generator, which were able to make anyway. I think it was this iron furnace and those bits generator, uh, electric motor, two coils, and two iron ingots. Then it was, I think, this way. No. Nah. The other way. Alright. Bam. What else do we need? Uh, six iron casings. Well, I only got the iron plates. Okay. <laughs> I guess I wasn't fully prepared as I said I would be. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's going to take a while. I got an iron shaft there. Iron shaft is for there. So basically, we're gonna wait for this. And done. Simple. <laughs> All right, let's uh, climb the. Uh, <laughs> uh, all the way up here. It's a slow climb. Hmm. Guessing I'll have the kinetic generator on this side. Uh, no, 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 that the cable's there. Okay, 
This will be interesting. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. So we need a kinetic generator to be on here. Hmm. I should have brought some stuff with me. Alright. Get ready. Oh, I did it. Yep, I jumped far enough. Oof, oof. Oof. I'm just gonna get some, uh. Yeah, we'll just dig up some dirt here. Four should be enough. <laughs> now we'll make the climb again. I just need to position things right so <laughs> I don't make any mistakes. <coughs> <sighs> long climb. Uh, long climb. Will be all worth it. So, how am I going to do this? Yep, that's how I'm going to do it. So, I'm going to have the kinetic generator facing this way and I'm gonna have the wind generator popping no that's not good okay there we go oh shit ah uh, that's a uh, jump oh what am I climbing down actually it's faster if I just climb back up and jump down I hope it didn't delete. <laughs> My god, how many times we gotta do a climb? <laughs> Sweet, it's still here. Uh, making up time. <laughs> I was hoping to be a nice, short, sweet, quick video with everything prepared, but still not prepared. Uh, oh well, we're almost done. Almost there. And then hopefully we don't need to use a normal generator at all because I've been really cooking through so much coal and I need to be environmentally friendly. Alright, let's see. Oop, that was a bit scary. And then I'm going to pop that there. I hope everything comes out alright. Rotor is missing, so you just throw that in. And then BAM! Done. Done skis. That's what you want. And it's producing 65.3 EUT. On the you know, creative server where I was uh, trying this out, when you put a better rotor piece, uh, you'll push out more power. As well as how high you go. Yeah. But this is producing more power than I had. Double, pretty much double the power I had. And no resources. So let's jump down and just have a look at that. Oh, oh crap. <laughs> I thought I was sweet. <laughs> I hope I didn't lose any pieces. Really hope. I don't want to lose any electrical tools. Alright, let, let's let's see what we still got. We've got the sword. Uh, I don't see much left. Ah. Ooh, wrench. Got two of my tools. Um Okay. I can't grab that at the moment. Let's see if I Alright, cool. There's Missing a chainsaw. There we go. <laughs> Roll cool. I totally didn't die. I totally didn't jump off into the water and looked up and bragged about my windmill. <laughs> and missed uh, the landing. Totally. Alright, so let's uh, check if um, everything is getting power. Well, that's 
Hmm. Nothing. Is this one set up properly? That should be filling up with power if it was done right. Okay. Okay, that's not filling up with power. So what did I do wrong here? Hmm. Hmm. What did I do wrong? Pretty sure this should be fine. Power doesn't seem to be flowing at the moment. I feel like it's this one. feel like that should be the other way. I heard him digging something. Ugh. Yeah, I should have had the um, yellow buttons facing upwards, not downwards. Bro, give me my stuff. Give me... yep, there we go. And I'll just place it up above, because that will be easier. He didn't have to come and fix the stuff I was going to do. Oh well. There we go, and now there's cobblestone missing. Well, we'll end this episode here, because he seems to be checking out my stuff. And, uh, next time we'll probably, uh, start working on some logistic pipe stuff. I need to really look up that sort of stuff. This should be fixed, yep. Their whole power generation is going the way it was supposed to be planned. And I'm stuck here, so who will end it. See ya.